Hey guys, welcome back to or welcome to my channel. If you haven't been here before, my name is Chai Nolton and if you have, thank you so much for watching my videos and supporting me. It really does mean a lot to me. So yeah. In today's video, as you can probably guess from the title, I'm doing an eBay haul. So yeah, I bought six things on eBay. I will be popping up the ads and the prices that I bought them for on the side when I show the item. Um, the items have been taken out of packaging and I know what each of them are just so I can make sure that I got them all. But yeah, but I haven't, there's only one package I opened and yeah. So let's get into it. So in this video I will be testing out or trying on the product that I did buy. So let's start off with all of the clothing. So the first thing I got, just because I'm a Harry Potter nerd. Hogwarts and as you can tell from my last couple of videos um, I will pop those down in the description and in the card somewhere so yeah so first item a pair of Gryffindor socks I've always always wanted them but I've never really wanted to pay the money for them but I did find them pretty cheap on eBay um, the ad should be up here somewhere so you can see the price that it was so yeah let's cut to me trying these on Here's to opening the socks and trying them on. Now with this I will be talking about the quality as I pull everything out. These feel real soft. I actually really like these. These are definitely cotton but they feel really soft and comfy. So yeah, let's see how they feel on my feet. These are actually so comfy and they feel pretty warm. I'll cut down to another shot where you see my feet and you can see what these look like. So here are the socks on. This is more the yoga ball. I don't use it. This is what they look like on. I'm actually quite happy with these. I like these a lot. I'm definitely going to be wearing these a lot. The next thing is the Gryffindor scarf. So Again, I've always wanted it, but I never wanted to pay the money. I found it real cheap on eBay, so I bought it. And yeah, I'm quite happy with it. Just talking about quality, the stock did feel good like through the packaging. They feel real soft and same with this. But I will talk more about quality when I take them out of the packaging. Now moving on to the scarf. And I should mention that the scarf and the sock did come from the same seller. Probably not that from the ad. Oh my god, you guys, this is so soft. This is so long and it feels so soft. It's not extremely thick, but it's not like paper thin. It's thin, but it will keep you warm. It feels so soft though. But you can definitely tell if you're wearing it the right way or not because the embroidery is very on this side but then on the other if not and there's a couple loose threads but not a big deal so yeah I love this definitely gonna be wearing this a lot and I do not care if I get called a nerd I do not care that I am turning 18 this year I'm still a child at heart and the next thing, a little sport jersey top, the Gryffindor one. I really love this. It reminds me of like back when I was playing sports when I was younger and you always wore this type of material shirt. As you can see, they like the actual jersey type stuff. So I love it. Feels really roomy. Comfy. So yeah. Uh, as you can see, I'm trying on the little body jersey top. To keep in mind, I am wearing a tank top under it, um, solely because this is that jersey material, so I've got all the little holes, but I was wearing a tank top before anyways under my jumper. But I am extremely happy with this. It feels really comfortable. There's room to move around and it's stretchy. And yeah, 
there's no actual like rips or tears in it and I'm really happy with it, definitely going to be wearing this a lot. It feels really good quality as well and it's actually a size large I'm pretty sure. So I am extremely happy with this. Now moving away from the clothing items, let's get into some of the practical items I got. So one of the first things I wanted was a microphone so I could get better audio on my videos. Um, this is out of packaging. I got the two for really cheap. The ad will be up here again. But yeah, it's like a little clip. It's got the foam stuff, great audio, two meter long cord, heavy duty. And it plugs into most devices. So iPads, laptops, phones, probably some computers and stuff. And with the headphone jack. I like this, it's real good. And actually I have used this in one or two of my videos. I used this in my last Harry Potter video that I posted and it, the, I used my laptop for the editing and for doing the voiceovers and the audio quality was amazing. So if you're starting a YouTube channel and you want good audio I would highly recommend getting these. Like they're really cheap but if you don't want to spend out all that money for the proper microphone, the audio surround then I would recommend this. It's a great place to start off and it gets you used to filming equipment, how close you need microphones for the audio to sound good. So yeah, I highly recommend and I'm happy with this. As you can tell in this clip, I am trying out the microphone as you can probably see it here. I'm not sure if the audio sounds too different on the iPad. It definitely makes a difference on my laptop. But comment down below if you actually think that the microphone is making a difference to the audio and I'm actually really happy with this. I like that it's got the phone bit and it's got the clip so you can put it anywhere and that it's got like a really long cord. So yeah. The next thing that I got that I had wanted for years is this tripod. This universal holder didn't come with it. It actually came with this. Um but I'm really happy with this. This looks quite small but and it's a phone holder but you just Stretch it out and it fits any phone. So this is a handy attachment. The tripod, um, pretty good. It's really bendy, it's the octopus tripod and it's got the quarter inch thread so anything else with that on it you can attach to it. And I got this baby separately, the universal um, device holder for tripod because I film on an iPad mini. Um, so I needed something that was bigger, but this does change sizes, so if I were to film with a different device or anything like that, it would fit it perfectly, and it fit on this perfectly. The other good thing about this is that you can actually lock it. So you've got this little dial at the back where you turn it like that and unlock it, and you can change the side and then you can lock it again. So I thought that was real good. It is plastic, but it's, you know, like, how you get the shitty shaped plastic but then you've got the really good heavy duty plastic that's what this feels like and this is these bits here are literally just like really really heavy duty foam to hold it in place so it feels good and down here you have the little clamp so you can make things tighter so I don't have fall and that's part of the tripod so I'm really happy with all these purchases so let's cut to the footage of me trying everything on and trying everything out. So yeah. Wait. And now for the one that I've been wanting to test out, the tripod. So let's get into that. Now after we adjust it to the size of the So now I am trying the tripod. It's taking a while because I just touched the record button. Now straight, I actually really like it. The only downside is, is that the tripod doesn't, the universal holder doesn't adjust far enough for me to have the iPad straight up like I normally do. But I actually really like the frame how it is. And I like that it's not showing my entire body. I am incredibly impressed with the tripod. To be honest, from the ad, I actually thought it was going to be a tiny bit more taller than it was. And I originally did order it in blue because I had blue, black, and red. But the blue on the site, like on the ad, it said that the black and red were out. So 
I was like, oh, blue is one of my favourite colours, I'll get that. And then I got a message from the seller saying that it was out in the blue, but they could send it to me in black. So yeah, I got the black. And I actually really like it. It's heavy duty, it's holding well, you can adjust it, you can adjust the stand because it is an octopus tripod. So yeah, anyway, that is all for today's video. I hope you guys liked it. Um, put a like on the video and subscribe to the channel to see more. I will have uh, the other eBay haul I had which included my actual formal dress um, that was actually an intentional video literally my mum and I just bought a lot of dresses on eBay um, back when I was in year 10 so I decided to just find all those dresses and make a video out of it and that got a lot of views on it so I had that in the card on the screen somewhere I'll have it in the description and in the end card so anyways I hope you guys liked this video and until next time bye